I remember Menudo very well. Not only were they invited over to our house by my father for barbecues and gatherings, but I also went backstage, concerts or gatherings they had. My dad was one of the guys that was choosing and selecting the new members of the group because the group members would cycle out. He would get very excited about selecting new boys that would come into the Menudo group. I remember him specifically taking one of the kids going off and saying he wanted to talk to him alone and they went off into the house upstairs. When you and Lyle and I met 33 years ago, you told me that Edgardo Diaz actually wanted to buy your father a Ferrari. I remember that they were close, that he would speak to him a lot. I remember my father would fly to the different concerts that Menudo would have around the world. So they were close partners. You know that I've been working on a story for a number of years following your father when he was head of our city records okay and we have found somebody who we believe was abused by your father okay as far as i know there's never been another person that's come forward and said they were abused by your father how do you feel about that? I I feel horrible. It's sad to know that there was another victim of my father. No one should have been forced to endure rape or molestation at the hands of my father. And I don't know how many, you know, I don't know how many more victims there are, and I suspect that there are more. Um, you know, I always hoped and believed that one day the truth about my dad and what he did great ball station would come out that, that I would be believed and for so long people just refused to believe it but I never wished for it to come out like this uh, uh, the result of, of trauma that another child has suffered and uh, kind of makes me very sad what, what is his name? His name is Roy Rossello he was a member of Menudo during what's called the golden era of the group in the 80s when the group was signed to RCA Records. And I believe I met Roy when I was, uh, when I was a boy. Do you have any uh, memories beyond just meeting him? No, I, I don't. But I met uh, many of the boys who went backstage for concerts or gatherings that they had. Uh, they also uh, invited over to our house by my father. When they were over at the house, he would have private meetings with boys one, one at a time. Did that seem unusual at all, that your dad was going in, into uh, uh, a bedroom with uh, individual members of Manu? I didn't question what my dad did. I didn't know what was what was weird and what was not, even what was happening in the station. My father, I, I didn't know that he was 